and this is alhamdulillah i hope all of you will get benefit from it the brother mentioned a lot of goods if we hold all what he said you know we will be succeed in this present life and hereafter because there no there is no other way we can succeed except one way is that to stick upon the book of Allah and the Sunnah of the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam according to the understanding of the Sahaba and anything that we need in our community how to build our brotherhood the Quran mentioned it the Sunnah of the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam mentioned it and those who came after them the way they build their community the way they bring people together they mention all of it so in our book you know anything we need we can find it but as if we leave all what we came from like our backgrounds behind everything we stick upon the book of Allah we will succeed that's why prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam said taraktu fikum shay'ain lan tadillu ba'dahuma kitab Allah wa sunnati prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam said that he left two things for us who will never be misguided if we stick and hold on those two things which is Allah's book and the sunnah of the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam what I mentioned he started with the verses in Surah Ala Imran Allah say, Wa atasimu bi hablillahi jami'an Allah say, all of us to hold upon the robe of Allah which is the book of Allah and the sunnah of the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam Abi Dawood, he mentioned in his book Al-Ha'iyya he said that Tamasak bi hablillahi wa tabi'u al-huda wa la taku bid'iyya la'allaka tuflihu he said that hold upon Allah's book and the sunnah of the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam do not be someone to innovate uh, if you want to be succeed so this is the only way if we want our brotherhood to be tied we have to hold upon the book of look at the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam when he came from Medina, mecca to medina the first thing that he did what was it what but one of among the first thing that he did to unite the community because it's important if there is no any uh, wahda you know unite between the community that community will not be able to progress so this one of the problem is affecting our community. And one thing else, the brother mentioned, which is about Tawheed, about Shirk. You know, if there's community that, you know, other people fall into Shirk or fall into things that can make them cause Shirk, that would broke us together. You know, so we have to unite upon the oneness of Allah, upon the right, and upon the believing. So I don't want to take it long. We have like uh, 15 minutes or 10 minutes to pray, inshallah. But I want to praise the brother for this great job that he did. He leave all what he was doing and answer to, and, and respond to our call to give us a lecture. Alhamdulillah, this lecture was very beneficial. And I hope a lot of you brothers will have a lot of good from it. And hope we'll have a good from it that will help us in this life and hereafter. And also any person, anyone that who spend your dollar, you know, whatever you spend to bring a food, you know, may Allah reward you. May Allah put that in your book, insha'Allah.